Hey everybody, so so sushi and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be playing Wander Song, which is kind of a cute little platformer, I guess it would be. Um it's an adventure game. It looks really cute. I've played about 10 minutes of it, but I restarted it because I got caught up on an area. So, uh hopefully we can get through that. I think I figured it out, but I'm not quite sure. So, well, we we can figure this out together. So, join me as I play Wander Song. Um, there's a lot of singing and a lot of, like, musical pieces to this, which make it cool. Plus, as you can see in the background, it's super sparkly and fabulous and colorful. And I just, I just hope it's going to be, like, a fun little game to share with you guys. So, here we go. Alright. Wonder song. Alright. So I don't know this guy's name, but I have learned that he can dance. You pick up dance moves. We can jump. Obviously. Because what game do you not jump in? Now I get this handy dandy sword. It's pretty schnazzy. Oh, okay, I get it. You'd think with already doing this as a playthrough, I would have. Ah! Understood a little bit better. I forgot about this part, honestly. <gasps> oh no, Mr. Bill. Poof! Look how little and cute she is now. Oh my gosh! You are so cute. I'm sorry for scaring you. This was supposed to test if you were a hero, which you're not. Well, that's just upsetting. Just a bard. Well, I guess I'm accepting of it, so that's cool. Who are you? Messenger of the goddess Aya. Forever ago, her song of creation set your universe into motion. And she's going to sing her song again pretty soon. Which, um, is going to replace this universe with a new one. But don't freak out too much about it too much. Your universe is pretty old. She likes to start over fresh after a while, you know? Yeah, it's not a big deal. Death and destruction, cool. Man. This sucks, actually. I really like you. Sorry your planet is doomed. I feel like that was insincere. Just saying. Act 1. Da 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 da! The haunting in Langtree. Sparkle, sparkle. I have a feeling my guy's a pussy. Go out the door. So when I first played this for that like ten minutes, I was sitting there trying to defeat defeat things with my gaming mouse, which has the num tab the uh, num pad on the side of it. And it wasn't working very well, and then I realized I have to actually use the actual number keys. Hey now, Wanderer. How were your dreams last night? That's a very peculiar question. I don't remember. They can be so easy to lose, can't they? Well, no worries. It's a beautiful morning. The birds are singing. What about you? Going to see the ghosts? Ghosts? A crowd of spirits took over town. Everyone's freaking out. It's pretty funny. Why is he so relaxed about- why is he wearing- there's so many questions about why. Just why with him. Well, see you around. Mask. Alright. So we jump with the birds, but you gotta sing to them first. And you have to copy their tunes, which is interesting to me. So we got... Like that. Whee! <gasps> oh no, come back. Okay, hold on. And I don't think you run out of time with them until later. Oh, you look pleasant. Sigh! Are you from around here? Yeah! Do you know the Overseer's song? Am I supposed to? 
What? Useless. I swear to Aya, this whole town. A few ghosts and everyone's useless. I don't have time to talk to you. The world is ending. Well, does she know the Overseer song? Because I feel like if she doesn't know it, then... What does she want for me? Well, fuck you, Miriam. Please. Do, do. I hear all the little birdies. The brightness and contrast of all this together pleases me. Oh, I have to go down. Q. No. Alright, where are we going? Why is he sleeping? Wake up! I can't wake him up. Why is there so much growling? Okay, so he's sleeping. So obviously that's an issue. We're not gonna get anywhere with that. Go figure. I was hoping that it would just take me down to like the bottom of this whole ledge thing here. So talking to her was useless. She helped none at all other than insult me. Hello, sir. Oh my goodness! Golly gee! Me oh my! Okay. What's going on? In my home right here, there is a real life bona fide ghost! What? I kind of want to see. Don't be a hero! The mayor already stormed into there! Well, she's doing a real good job. A while ago! And she still hasn't come out! It's the end of Lane Tree as we know it! Alright, Clyde. Is that the mayor? Ooh, the spaghetti monster! God dang ghost, think you can mess with my town? And this is where the numb keys come in. You gotta sing to them and they explode into ghost things. See? They shrink. Ooh. Baby spaghetti ghost. Are they gonna do something? I don't know what those mean. I feel like I should. It's probably ghost language. Well, I'll be. Guess you're saying I actually did something for once. Why is everybody so mean to me? I'm so smiley. Yeah! You're a good kiddo. But we're still up to our necks and ghosts today, so stay out of trouble. I guess she was kind of nice about it. I don't know, though. I was trying to sing and live my best life. Marley and Francine's house. Okay. Hello. Hello, little bird. I've been hiding here from all the ghosts. If I wait long enough, mayhaps they'll go away. What are you doing? Hiding, singing, saving the town. Saving the town. I'm not singing to you guys. Oh my, what a little hero. Do be careful, little bird. Saving the town is what mayors are for. I don't think that's true. They usually run away. Or tax too much. In my experience as an adult. Okay, I didn't want to go that way yet, but I guess here we go. Bartlett! Oh, goodness! A dark spirit appeared in Ruby's house. I tried to get her out, but... Well, you know how stubborn she can be. She's such a sweet, sweet old girl. I'm questioning this. If something happened to her, I... You what, Francine? What would you do? Oh, she looks mean and miserable. And she doesn't give a fuck about this ghost. Alright, let's do this ghost. Oh, they don't have colors anymore. But I got this. Fuck you, ghost. Not even skipping a beat. Bam! Spaghetti ghost. Gone. Almost. He's gotta talk to me in his weird secret spaghetti ghost language. 
I wonder if you ever decrypt, just decrypt, decrypt, is that a word? Did you just sing that spirit away? Yep. Good thing it's out of your hair, huh? No. It wasn't bothering me. Do you just run singing into everybody's homes? Well, yeah, when it's gonna save you, generally. Oh, Ruby, you're kind of a douche. And I'm somebody that likes elderly people. But I don't like that elderly people. Well, is Ruby alright? She's great. Thank goodness. Why couldn't she go check on her? You really are a hero, Bartlett. Ruby's just so kind and gentle. No. A sweet woman like her doesn't deserve to be haunted. Mm. Sure, Ruby. Alright, we're gonna go back this way. There's really no place to go that way. Oh, look at it. There's a hill. No! Stop. Boop. Hello, good sir and your son, I think. I... I'm scared! Fair enough. Eyes. If, if it isn't the Bartling, watch yourself today. The ghosts around town are proving quite a problem. I tried scaring off the one in our house with my axe, but I wasn't very afraid of axes. Hopefully the mayor can sort it out soon. I don't do a very good guy voice, I guess. Especially, you know, with that beard. Look at that beard. Bring a ghost! Oh, he disappeared. Now these don't even have sounds to them. There we go. I'm liking the music. I don't know if I got that- okay, I didn't get it wrong. I thought I got it wrong. Alright, go talk to me, Spaghetti Monster. Alright. Alright. Let's talk to the mayor again. Talk around town is that you saying away all the ghosts? And here I thought birds w birds weren't worth a thing. Haha, uh, yeah. I got a favor to ask you. Well, after that, I don't know. You got time to perform more miracles? Heck yeah! Lion Tree's got a spirit protector called the Overseer. He can tell us what's with the ghosts here. To visit him, you just gotta learn his song. Do you know the song? Well, yeah. Can you sing it to me? That wasn't what I had in mind. I ain't a great singer. Okay, then what? You can do it. I don't want to sing this to you. But we're gonna tell her she can do it. And I'm still not singing it. Yeah, I really ain't so sure about that. Okay, never mind. There's one other person who'd know the song. Heck of a singer, too. Who? Ruby. Fuck Ruby. That grumpy old lady? Yep. And she's the only other one who knows it. Darn tootin'. Ruby acts rough, but I swear she's got a kind old heart in there. Just ask nicely. I'm not sure about this. Ugh. Hi, Ruby. I want to learn the song of the Overseer. Do you know anything about that? Uh, no. And I've about had it with you coming into my house with your demands. All right, first off, listen, lady, I saved you from a big-ass spaghetti ghost. And you're gonna sit here and talk about my demands? Ruby! Oh, good, the mayor's here. Now, that kind of attitude just ain't right. You really don't remember the Overseer song? No. 
Really? That song you sang all the time? You know, back in the day with Ron? And at the gatherings around the big old tree? That song that was your job to sing for that? Every year? You really don't remember that one. Oh yes, that song. I may remember it. Can you sing it? I'll only do it once. All right, let's get to it. Okay. This is hard. Oh no, this is going terribly. It wasn't terrible. Like, that wasn't... Okay, that was terrible. That, that wasn't great. We'll put it that way. So that's how it goes? Thank you, Ruby. I knew you weren't really that huge a jerk. I sang the song for you. You can all get out now. Always a pleasure, Ruby. Kiddo, meet me in town. Fair enough. Okay, so... Meet her in town. We're gonna go. Meet her in town and... Maybe call it quits after that? We'll see. We'll see how far in the game we get. See what happens next. Alright, so back to town. Town is very, very small. Three houses I don't feel is really even a village. Uh oh. Oh, three spaghetti monster ghost things. Let's do this. Haha! Haha, spaghetti ghosts. Spaghetti ghosts! I got you. It's a Seagram's kind of night. Alright. Kiddo! You know the way to the tree of slumber? No! It's out the left of town and up that hill. Sing the song to the tree. I have to sing a song to a tree. I'll stay here and make sure my folks are safe. What good am I without singing? I don't know, but... Okay, to the left. What's in here? Nothing! Alright, so out of town to the left. Oh, that was the mayor's house. Why didn't the mayor's house have ghosts? Especially if she can't sing. I find that pretty sketchy. That's not the left. This is the left. My computer just glitched. We are now in the matrix. Alright, up the hill. Doody doody doody. Swiggity sooty. Coming for that booty. Q. This better be the way. Okay, well, he's not sleeping anymore. Oh, I have to sing to the tree. Aw, the tree likes my singing. Aw, look at me doing okay. For the most part. Oops. It's like a weird guitar hero with magical trees and spaghetti monsters. All hail the spaghetti monster! Oh, look at it! She's back! <laughs> Welcome to the spirit world. Singing to a tree killed me. I remember you! 
What are you doing here? I delivered my message, so... Just drifting around your world. Vicariously feeling Aya's unconditional love for all existence. Stuff like that. So... You're real? Uh, yeah? Pretty much, yeah. And the world is ending. Yeah. So, how do we stop it? Stop what? How do we stop the world from ending? Duh. Cosmic creature. Well, the one thing that could stop it would be if someone sang the Earth song. That's it? I can do that. How does it go? Oh man, it's like... So not that easy. The Earth song has no melody. It carries the combined will of all life on this planet. It's a whole thing. Well, how do I learn it? Talk to the overseer here. Big castle. Can't miss it. Like, a quest? Haha, <laughs> yes. Good luck, little bard. Hearts. Hearts and giggles. And sunshine. So we're going to a big giant castle that we can't miss. How true is that? Uh, you sing these to groom. Okay, well, I'm going to assume this is that their castle we were just talking about. Now, I did learn that in order to do this. Oh no, shrink back down, little leaf thing. In order to get anywhere. You have to sing these to life, pretty much. Which is fine. That's a cute little dynamic to the game. Holy hell, what is happening? Okay. Uh, oh, I just scraped my head. That was no bueno. Uh, okay. Cool. Uh, I don't know how far down or how far up all these go. Right. Go back up. I'm not good at controlling these apparently. This is terrible. Okay, so we just came in from there. I can get this birdo. I really don't like the fact that I can't see what's happening. That did nothing! Oh, good gravy. Alright, so I can s maybe? Okay, so apparently you have to save the birds for when you want to jump. Oh no! I don't know what that was about. My computer did not like the all that shiznut. Oh look at the little flowers are turning colors as I pass them. That's kind of cute. All right, no, go back. Ah, oh. all right. I'm just always afraid that it's gonna run out of like vine. I guess you would call it. 
Ah, oh, shish kebabs. Nope. Oh! You don't have to be on them in order to get them to come to you. That's pretty schnazzy. Oh, when they run out of vines, they're done. Or leaves, rather. That's pretty cool. Good thing to take note of. At least this doesn't have a life thing. Oh no! I pushed the wrong buttons. At least I didn't fall off the cliff. Come on, little leaf thing. You my bobbers. Hmm. I like the indoors ones. They make me happy. Me, little birdo. Well, that did nothing. I need you back. Do, do, do. No! I need to save the bird. I had a really hard time the first time I played it going through this. This was where I ended it because I just I couldn't I couldn't understand how to get through there, but I also didn't know you had to save the birds or that you could save the birds. I thought they had like a timer on them and that's when they poofed, but it was just because I jumped. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna get to a good spot in the castle. And call it quits for this episode. I don't know what it's doing. Oh. Alright, that did not help me at all. Oh. I'm hoping I don't need another birdo. Alright, there we go. Ooh, look at all the shooting stars in the background. How lovely little yellow trees. That wasn't the castle, this is the castle. Ugh. Alright, so we started off our adventure. Took over, you know, the spaghetti town or the spaghetti ghosts in the town and pretty much made it to our castle, trying to save the world with our songs. That's the gist of what I've got through this so far. Nobody likes me, I'm kind of a loser, but I'm going to save the world and change everybody's mind. So with that being said, I'm going to end this here. Uh, part two will be coming up very, very soon. And thank you guys for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the playthrough. And I'll see you next time. Have a good night.